Hello there, my name is Caitlin Liner and I'm the author of the Soul Prophecy series. For the past seven years I've been learning the ins and outs of writing and publishing books. It's been a steep learning curve, but I've just finished writing my fourth book, The Quantum Messenger. I've had many questions about my series, so I thought I would answer some of those questions here on YouTube. I will be making more videos and if you have any questions for me, then please leave them in the comments section below. The Soul Prophecy series revolves around the idea of the human soul and the existence of an afterlife. This isn't an afterlife with a god or angels or demons. It's an individual afterlife controlled by the consciousness. The energy which fuels a person's existence in the afterlife comes from their soul and an ancient force which I call the positive force. The soul is shaped by a person's life experience through their emotions and conscience. The series focuses on different characters and how they react to the world and circumstances around them. Some characters have to come to terms with death and grief, whilst others have to deal with guilt and love. One of my biggest questions involves time and where and how the afterlife exists. I came up with the idea of a second timeline which contains all future possibilities for every living person. I name this timeline the Now Timeline, and it spirals around time as we know it past, present, and future. The afterlife exists on the now timeline, and within a field between the now timeline and time. Some of my characters are able to manipulate this field and the now timeline in order to see into the future. Which leads me to the quantum messenger. The quantum messenger is about Apollo, the first sentient robot. His story isn't just about his own self-exploration, he learns to recognise feelings and independent thoughts as he develops a soul. Not only does he try to reason and rationalise his own thoughts and behaviour, and those of the humans around him, he's aware of something else inside, something beyond life. His name is important to him, given by a child who he loved and betrayed in a lesson of regret that becomes central to his character. Quantum Messenger explores the idea of mankind's ability to create an artificial intelligence that is so great it becomes aware of itself and develops its own thoughts and feelings. The idea of a superior intelligence being able to answer mankind's biggest questions is not a new concept, but it is fascinating to think that perhaps an AI could explain what may or may not happen to us after we die. If you like the sound of this story, then click on the links in the description box below this video. I would like to say a big thank you to everybody who has helped me get this far, and thank you for watching this video.